Here in Washington, the House Select Committee investigating the January 6th attack is collecting new information ahead of more public hearings later this month. Still, a question persists. Was the conduct leading up to the Capitol attack criminal? Here is CBS's Scott McFarland. The committee investigating the U.S. Capitol attack is talking publicly about the possibility they'll recommend the first ever criminal prosecution of a former president. I think there was evidence that the former president engaged in uh, multiple uh, violations of the law, uh, and that should be investigated. Despite concerns about how divisive it could be for the country, for the Justice Department to prosecute a former president and possible candidate, Congresswoman Liz Cheney says there's a greater danger. I think it's a much graver constitutional threat if a president can engage in these kinds of activities and, um, you know, the majority of, of the president's party looks away uh, or we as a country decide you know, we're not actually going to take our constitutional obligations seriously. In her blockbuster testimony last week, former Trump White House aide Cassidy Hutchinson said Trump knew the crowd he directed toward the Capitol included people who were likely armed, and that he not only failed to intervene when the mob attacked, but further fueled them with a tweet disparaging then-Vice President Mike Pence. The committee says new witnesses have come forward in the days since Hutchinson's testimony. Every day we get new people that come forward and say, hey, I didn't think maybe this piece of a story that I knew was important, but now that you guys are, like, I do see this plays in here. CBS News has learned Trump has privately told allies he's considering announcing a 2024 presidential run as early as this summer, even as the committee reveals its investigation into what it calls a conspiracy by Trump and others to defraud the United States. At the right time, I'll be saying what I want to do. A campaign announcement by the former president could also double as an attempt by Trump to insulate or shield himself from the investigation. It could also take some steam out of Republicans ahead of the midterm elections in a year in which they think they're poised to steamroll to victory. Major? They do indeed, Scott. Scott McFarland, thank you.